I don't want to joke because I know he's just going to try to put me on the internet. I don't want to joke. But I'm postmaster here. He can't yeah. throw me out. For, are you trespassing me from the post office? Yeah. So you arrest me for trespassing. Yep. If I do not leave this post yep. office. Yep. The postmaster wants you off the property. You, as a supervisor, a supervisor, you are telling me that if I don't leave the post office simply because I was taking photographs, that I will be arrested. You're law enforcement. You are not feelings enforcement. It's your job to enforce the law. I'm not breaking the law. Your attempts to subvert my constitutional rights aren't going to go over well for you today. So Is there a about... sign in here that says that he can photograph in here? It's some federal statute. They got like a whole YouTube channel. They go. They literally just drive city to city and do it. My name's actually Mike Norton on KULT News. I'd like to know why you're trying to violate my constitutional rights. Hey everybody, KULT News back again with another video. We are here today in Athens, Ohio, as always, to peacefully exercise our First Amendment right to film in public and publicly accessible areas, to promote transparency and accountability within our government, and to ensure that our public servants recognize our rights and treat us with respect. Let's get into it. So, Athens, Ohio is a relatively liberal town. It's the... Uh, home of Ohio University, and not to be confused with Ohio State University. And Ohio University is actually older than Ohio State. They're very proud of that here in Athens. Um, the town had about, I'm going to say, 24,000 people in 2020. A little old glory, a little tiny one here. Back here? Yep, all this. I'm sorry, did I miss it? I'm yeah. sorry, who are you? I'm the postmaster. Oh, I didn't. Was there a signage back here? My yeah. apologies, I didn't realize there was a yeah. sign. Yeah, this back here is federal property to where our employees park our vehicles and stuff. I'm sorry. What was your? And you're the postmaster. You're, what was your name? Adam. Adam. Hey, my name is Mike. But there's no. This is this is. She says federal. So I can't kind of cut through here. Yeah. This is all. Uh, there's no sign that says it's private property though. I miss it. I'm, I apologize. Yeah, I don't want to. I don't want to go where it's authorized personnel only. Thank you for bringing that to my attention. No problem. Last thing I want to do is step in the town for five minutes and get myself in trouble. No, you're good. Let's see. I need updated, but yeah, anything back here is all federal stuff. So. Authorized vehicles. Oh, what does it say? You can't go back there. U.S. property. No trespassing. It's federal property, right? Federal property. Oh, it's public property. This is not federal. This is not public property back here. It's up front, yes, sir. It's public it's property. So, but where does this apply, though? This says no trespassing. I'm so confused. That's not a. That's not legitimate. You realize people can go back there, right? You understand that legally, I could go back there if I, I wanted to. Appreciate you, sir. Have a great day. I understand. I could if I wanted to, and I may want to shortly. Interesting. I'm definitely gonna test that one out. Yep, yep, we're gonna go check out our post office here. seen one of those inside a post office. Very cool. i tell you what, I decided to add a little joke just to cover up the silence. So a guy walks into a bar and he's got like a ship's wheel attached to his, well, it looks like his crotch. And the bartender says, hey, buddy, what's with that wheel there on your crotch? And then the uh, the guy says, "Arg, it's driving me nuts." Uh, am I in your way here? No, no, no. I thought I was in your room. Oh no, no, you're fine. You're fine. I just trying to figure out which package is best. Athens, Ohio. 
today, please? I got, I got a question. What's the mind that one? The person I turned on here in town. I got some YouTube sensation down here set up with a camera in my office, like taking videos of customers and stuff in my front while they, they tried to go around back and where my vehicles are. I told me couldn't get back there with private property, federal property trespassing. I just got a camera set up in my lobby. Okay, and you we'll guys get him out of here. Thank yeah, you. We'll put him down. Uh, boy. safety issues, stuff like that. So now he's in there taking videos of customers. The privacy concerns. People have got the addresses on their stuff, possible payment information he could be getting. Okay. okay. So, I just... Huh? If, yeah, if you guys want him gone. Yeah, I don't want him. You want him trespassed? Or just uh, leave the property? Just leave the property? Yeah. yeah. Okay. So you can't take my picture. I'm in the witness protection. <laughs> I don't want to deal with him because I know he's just going to try to put me on the internet. I don't want to deal with him. want you off the property. The post office? Yeah, yep, the post office the they want you off the property. So. I'm just, uh, for what? They, I'm where you tried to walk around the back of the property, they don't want you in here filming, they want you off the property. So you're more welcome to go out to the sidewalk, but you, they do not want you in the building. We're in public. Is it a crime to be in the, I, I'm, so what did I do in here? What they, did I do to instigate? They don't want you on the property anymore, but, so now you have to, you need to leave the property. But why? Did they say why? Yeah, because you were trying to walk back behind on federal property that they don't want you back there, and then you come in here and start recording, and they don't want you recording customers and everything else like that. Now, I did talk with Adam, the postmaster, and I'm, I'm sorry, can I get your, uh, was it? Do you Simpson? Have badge? We don't have badge yeah. numbers. Simpson. Simpson. Marcinko. Marcinko. Yeah. So, <laughs> there's no signage back there saying I can't go back. I'm just walking through the public parking lot in the post office, there's no signs back there. You go back there and look. No signs that say you can't walk back here. He came out and said, excuse me, I'm the postmaster. You, you can't come back here. I immediately said, oh, I'm sorry. I didn't see any signs. So then he showed me a sign on the side of the building that says no trespassing. It didn't say you can't go back there. There is no signage at all that says I can't go back behind this post office. There's certainly no signage inside that says the First Amendment doesn't apply here. So respectfully, gentlemen, I'm going to have to ask you to allow me to continue practicing my constitutional right to take the, photos in public. The postmaster here he, can't he, throw me out. For, are you trespassing me from the post office? We can, he, do, he wants you just he off does, the property. He, he, he has said no he, right. This is public. I'm in public. That's like walking in and he says, oh, sir, you're wearing a MAGA hat. You can't be in here. Tough luck. If I have a camera in the post office, that's my prerogative. I have two cameras, in fact, in the post office, and it is my prerogative. It's my first, uh, first Amendment right to come into the post office and take photographs of anything I see. There's an old saying, if you can see it, you can shoot it. Now, in Texas, they take that a little, little too literally, but that means photography. There are really only a few places in America I can't take photos. Courtrooms, bathrooms, dressing rooms, and locker rooms. This is none of those. In fact, there's a sign right in the other room there that I'd like to show you gentlemen if you'd like to that very clearly says I can photograph in this post office. 
So, unless you have anything else, I will dismiss you. They, they want you off the property. And if I don't leave the property, am I going to be arrested for trespassing? trespassing? So you arrest me for trespassing yep. if I do not leave this post Yep, office. the postmaster wants you off the property. May I have your supervisor here, please? I am the supervisor. So, to be clear, you as a supervisor, a supervisor, you are telling me that if I don't leave the post office simply because I was taking photographs, that I will be arrested. So I'm leaving under penalty of under threat of arrest. Is that clear? Based off of that the postmaster Wait. wants you off and if he signs a trespass notice and you refuse to leave, yes. Have signed a trespass notice. Okay. We will. And I would like to have your supervisor here, sir, because you're making a grave mistake. This is my constitutional right to take photos and videos in public. Constitutional right. It's in the First Amendment, sir. And the fact that you're trying to tell me I can't take photos or videos in public or I will be arrested is an absolute outrage and it will not be accepted. Absolutely not. So you might want to call that, contact your boss and tell your boss, I'm about to trespass a man from the U.S. Post Office for taking photographs. Okay. See how that goes over. You're inviting a big lawsuit on the city of Athens. I'll tell you that right now. Okay. Big mistake, my friend. Okay. I suspect these ladies over here probably agree that the First Amendment kind of overrides the, uh, the hurt feelings of the gentleman inside. You're law enforcement. You are not feelings enforcement. It's your job to enforce the law. I'm not breaking the law. And I'll be damned if I'm going to have you turn my constitutionally protected right into a crime. Shame on you. You took an oath to uphold and sustain the Constitution, and you were here trying to violate my constitutional rights. I will not stand for this, sir. Do you have any other identifying information other than T. Simpson? No badge number, because there's something that you have a card. We just don't have that big enough department to where we... Is your, is your camera recording, sir? Yes, it is. Okay, good. I'm going to get the copy of that as well. Okay. Catch you a conversation with Adam in here who thinks it's a crime to photograph things in public. Unbelievable. You guys got some nerve. Been in this town for 10 minutes. I'm being told I can't take photos in public. Unbelievable. And when I'm done here... You and I can step outside and show me where it says I can't walk back behind this building. Show me where it says that. Okay. All right? So, he does not want to leave. So, okay. would you want to sign a notice of criminal trespass? And then we can, if he refuses to leave again, because you've asked him to leave, correct? Yeah. Well, I told him he couldn't go around back. If he's happy but, to stand out there... Okay, so That's if you fine. so if he if he's out there, he's fine. Sure, he just can't come in here. We're doing retail processes. I got payment information, address, stuff like that. Okay, so okay, but he's okay. As long as he's not bothering my customers, I don't care. He just can't come in here. We're doing retail operations. Okay, so I suppose is there a bother. sign in here that says that he can photograph in here? It's some federal statute. They got like a whole YouTube channel. They go. They literally just drive city to city and do it. Okay. But he's okay to be in there. Sure. Okay. He just tries to get a reaction out of people. Like I that. know he does. I know he does. But so to be clear, you, do you want mm -hmm. him I don't to be? Do that, he's just gonna put that online. I don't want to deal. I'm not okay. Gonna, but as long as he stays out there where we're not doing transactions and not bothering my employees. Like, All right. Well, see, the thing is, so if he's out there, it is what it is. Yep. So if he's if somebody's out there filling out paperwork and stuff like that, and as long as you say he can be out there, I mean, it's kind of hard for us to enforce something if you're saying he can be out there. Okay? Yeah. So. I mean, I'm more than welcome just to be like, okay, man, I talked to the postmaster. He said just go ahead and see you can be out here, but you can't go in there. So. So it's up to you. Sir, you are trying to violate my rights. I mean, you're uh, bobbing the listen, police to do so. Listen, let's go back out here and talk. If I don't go out there to talk with you, are you going to arrest me? No. Listen, no, I'm not interested. They don't in want with you. you in here. I'm not they said you can you. be out there. I'm sitting over here, be nice and quiet, and I'm going to stand right here and be nice and quiet. And there's nothing you legally can do about okay. it. Okay. Listen, sir. They said that you can go out there and you can film all they all you want. Right here. Adam, you might want to read this, pal. 
It's called Poster 7. Right there on your wall it says I can take photographs and video on here. I'm staying here. You have a copy of that? You, you might want to call somebody because you're about to invite a serious lawsuit on yourself, my friend. I'm not going anywhere. The First Amendment is more important than your feelings. You call the ambulance, not the police, pal. He says they can be out here and record, and that's all that's fine. He's just not. They don't want him in here. Okay. So. Nobody up real quick. We're here with an iPhone. Really? Adam, come on. You got an iPhone, please. He, like they said, you're more than welcome to. They signed the trespassing order. They want you out Sir, here filming. Sir, I will dismiss you. you without further argument. I'm done talking with you about this today. Either get a trespassing order signed, and I will leave under threat of arrest, or leave me alone. Okay. Well. You slept and you find somebody that knows their rights, doesn't it? Unbelievable. You people See, are something else. Right, is this... Come on in, they're trying to violate my rights. Come on, you can't even get pictures. I violate your skills. Oh, wait, sir. There's a woman here with a camera. Can you get her too? this point As long as he's not bothering customers and filming the actual transactions, okay, he's good. Okay. So, well, the reason I called the first two customers is because they looked at him and wondered what he was doing. Okay. So, he's just trying to. Yeah, yeah that's why he tried to doing yeah. this. What kind of postage do you have on the back? Is it just on the set of signs that says no trespassing? U.S. Says, government, no trespassing. Yeah. So, it's pretty much from the start of the fence or from the start of the sign? It's literally it's right here on the corner of the building. Okay. Yeah. All right. Okay. All right. Thank you, sir. You signed a trespass order? Nope. Didn't think so. Tell you what, I can make you guys a deal. You will leave, and within three minutes, I'll leave. You no, the, we're no, we're we're we're. Are you going to long haul? Huh? You stick around? No, we're 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 taking off. No, oh, you are going to leave. Yeah, they don't want to sign the trespass. You know why? Because he would lose his job if he did, and you would lose your job if you arrested me for this. Shame on you. And you know what? Yeah, I do have something for you guys. Actually, I want to ask you. My name's actually Mike Norton on KULT News. I'd like to know why you're trying to violate my constitutional rights. Yeah, that's called the walk of shame. Keep well, walking. We had a complaint, and we're keep here walking. To, we're here to talk. Yeah, your complaint, complaint was I was getting bored in public. Complaint about what? Public photography. Keep walking. That's called the walk of shame there, guys. You should be embarrassed. Is this what you came, became police officers for? So you could harass people in public for taking photos? Stimson? You're a lieutenant? you have anything to say about this lieutenant? Huh? Hey, Stimson, before you head out, you want to tell, show me where the no trespass sign is back here? Because I'm going around back next. you have anything to say? Right there. Where? U.S. property. Right there in the sign. Yeah. Okay. U.S. Right, no trespass. Oh, I agree. This is U.S. property. Yeah. No, no trespass trespassing. Anymore. After the, after behind this line. So after this line, I'm trespassing. You tell me I'm trespassing here, but I'm not trespassing here. They don't want you back behind the building. There's no says, sign that says they can't go back behind the, the building. No trespass. What about the other way? If I go around the other way, you don't like that? Let's let's have a, let's have a little fun, shall we? I'm gonna go back there right now while you watch. Let's see if you arrest me and what happens to the city of Athens, shall we? Okay. Come on. You wanna come okay. back with me? Come on, have the sign no trespasser. I'm gonna circle all the way around the building, and I'm gonna come back here, and you should be gone by then, and then I'll leave. Thank you. Unbelievable. No sign is back here. Stamson, you don't wanna give me a trespassing? Come on! Unbelievable. See the signs back here? They say I can't be back here. No. The vehicles and their contents. No, no. Unbelievable.
Is Adam here? I'd like to speak with him momentarily. Adam, are you back there? Mm -hmm. I'd like to speak with you momentarily. Okay. My name is Mike Norton. I'm with KULT News. Okay. I'd like to know why you called the police for me being in your in your in your uh, because the customers post office. Were getting concerned. They were looking Which back. customers? I was just worried. If I was worried. They Which customers like, said something? You're being. I'm asking you a question. Aggressive. Which customers? Absolutely, I'm aggressive. You just I'm called worried, the police on me for uh, being in the post office. I'm worried about customer privacy. Uh -huh. That's it, sir. Really? Yep. Do you think I can see anything personal over there from way out of that corner? Really? It's possible. Yeah, Do you think absolutely. it's possible? Did you know they have a sign in your post office that says I can take photos and videos in here? As long as you're not bothering customers and involved. I wasn't bothering anybody. You I called the police worried. on me. I was There's worried about two customers problems. right there. Did I bother you? Bothered bothered me. You never bothered me. Look at that. Okay. So who did I bother? I was worried about customers. Are you reading minds? Have a good day, guys. Yeah, next time call a ambulance, pal. Unbelievable. Thank you very much. Just curious. Joe? Joe, are you a veteran by chance? Thank you for your service, sir. Thank you. Thank you for your service. And thank you, gentlemen, for being professional. I'm sorry your boss is such a sniveling little whiner. <laughs> See you next time there, Adam. This won't be my last visit to your post office. All right. Well, that was fun. So I think we taught Adam postmaster here at the uh, Athens, Ohio post office a lesson. Same with Officer Stimson and Officer, what was that, Mercado or something or another. Uh, it was really disappointing, not surprising, but very disappointing. Officer uh, Stimson, a lieutenant, by the way, he is a supervisor. Shocking. Uh, <laughs> he looked like he was a deer caught in the headlights. Uh, and, and you notice how when you pull the microphone out, how they tuck tail and run. Now, they did claim that they were on their way out of the post office before I pulled the mic out. So, I don't know. But I think they're going to make one last attempt to try and get me to voluntarily leave the post office. Uh, I do need to start making a point of controlling my temper a little bit. I, I'm, not, I'm not easily angry, but there's something about having law enforcement officers with guns on their hips telling me, I can't take photographs in public. It's unacceptable. Nobody should accept that. And I simply don't. So I kind of expected uh, a little better out of uh, liberal Athens, Ohio, but Athens, Ohio post office, massive fail. Mike Norton, KULT News, Athens, Ohio. something else. Come on in. They're trying to violate my rights. Pull out your camera and take some pictures. They'll violate yours too. Oh, wait, sir. Come out. There's a woman here with the camera. You gonna get her too? Unbelievable. May I ask I why people are complaining? You weren't doing anything when I was in here. No, you weren't, dis you weren't disrupting anybody. And it was everything was calm and p peaceful until you were asked to leave by law enforcement. I honestly don't understand why that happened. It's crazy. I was in here. I did my business. You didn't bother me. I got in here. You weren't blocking anything. You weren't standing in the way. I did my business. I paid for my package. I left. I saw the police pull up. I wanted to see what was going on. I don't understand why you won't. I don't know, officer. The customers are in here. They're not bothered at all. They're baffled as to why the police are called in the first place. And you know what? And, and I'm not a big gambling man, but I bet money on the fact that the gentleman here that kind of looks a little like a Santa Claus, I'll bet he agrees with me. He seems like the kind of man who respects the First Amendment, and he knows full well that calling the police is a snivelly little whiny thing for Adam to do. He's a crybaby, and he should have called the ambulance, not the police. You don't like a man in your, in your post office with cameras? With cameras? Go, don't call the police who have more cameras and guns. Your attempts to subvert my constitutional rights aren't going to go over well for you today, sir. Don't you have serious crimes to handle in this city? Is crime so slow here that... Huh? Thank you, sir. 
You signed a trespass order? No. Didn't think so. I'll tell you what, I can make you guys a deal. You leave, and within three minutes, I'll leave. We had a complaint, and we're here. Complaint about what? Complaint about what? This is insane. I mean, what did our Bedouins fight for if not to be able to take pixels in a public place? Right. They don't like, well, they don't like accountability. This is insane. He did nothing. He did nothing wrong. Like, he didn't bother me. I didn't bother him. It was perfectly... Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, I am. Really? These guys suck big time. Really? Big time. God, Please stand out your here. Hand. That's all. Yeah, Absolutely. Just, like, I, 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 I watch. What's, what's your name? My name's Justin. I'm obsessed with these. Yes, I love now, them. Now, which one is your favorite? And I'll tell you who inspired us. Okay, so I love Long Island. My favorite. Um, I love Emma Gansett. Second Press. favorite. There really? you go. You You're know why me. those are your favorites? Because they're professional. They're not. The ones that piss me off are the people that go out and they and they instigate things with cops. They go up to a pair of cops talking in the parking lot and they're like, hey, what are you losers doing wasting taxpayer dollars? Can I, can I pull right yeah, here yeah, so yeah, I can yeah, talk to you? I'm going to pop in and tell the post office master. Yeah, he failed miserably. Well, I still want to talk to you about Yeah, yeah. Pull on over. I'll, I'll talk to you in a minute. There you go. People love the First Amendment audit.